So what I want to do now is start with a more complex sound source. I'm going to use the Qubit Nebula. It's a C sound module. C sound is running inside. And it actually is a granular processor that processes samples and granularizes them. So I'm going to take the output of the Qubit Nebula and plug it into the external input. Well, before I do, the sound sounds like this. But now I'll take the external input and now the sound darts like this. Okay, but now we're listening to the system one with the nebula as its source. No oscillators. So now what I'd like to do is maybe um, control the nebula's, uh, pardon me, control the system one's filter. So let's take an LFO from this oscillator and uh, plug it into the uh, filter. So let's trigger our sound. Okay, might be nice to leave it open and running again, so I'll go back to the system one, turn on key hold, play a note, let it run, while I now fine tune a little bit of what I'm doing with the filter. this kind of almost like distorted, modulated sound from the filter. Okay. Now, let's take that same modulator and go back and control the sample player. hear this slow fluttering. This is a lot. We've come far away from the original drum sample we started with. Now, can we get back to that? Of course we can. So there's our original again, but here's with the LFO on the filter. Quivering. And here's the LFO on the sample player itself, exaggerating it even more. All right. So, one direction to go. And again, what we're doing here is we're combining maybe a different set of sources. I'm taking advantage now of the System 1M's filter, which is a really exciting filter, and I'm voltage controlling it with some other module. And wait, that same voltage controlled signal is synchronizing the sort of stuttering going on in the waveform playback. So that's the whole exciting thing about voltage controlled synthesizers is the way that one signal can go to many, many places and can go to very different places maybe than a, a, a kind of pre-wired synthesizer would let you go. System 1M is starting to give you the chance to get inside and rewire the system and explore and have a lot more fun sort of making sounds. Thank <laughs> you.